contact tracing is a big topic and many companies have said they've wanted to create their own apps, but so far none of them are available here in the US. Let's get right to it, here's the buzz. Developers say they've been facing a lot of technical roadblocks and user participation has been pretty low so far. The reliability of Bluetooth signals has also been a challenge, but eventually they want to create a system where your phone will receive a notification if you've come in contact with someone who tested positive for COVID-19. And it looks like most people are worried life will possibly never return to being normal. About 75% of Americans think that this will be our new norm, our days that we're facing right now. According to a new survey, what people envision the most in the wake of COVID-19 is how different work will be. About 60% of people say they would be scared to start working in a shared environment again, while 36% worry going back to the office would put their family in danger. And we've got to show you this video. A boy and a toddler escaped a fire at an apartment in southeastern France after they jumped into the arms of residents. Check this out. These two brothers, aged three and 10 years old, were hanging from a window. You can see it there as flames engulfed their home and onlookers below were screaming for them to just jump down. The boys were hospitalized alongside 17 of the building's residents after inhaling smoke. But there is some good news in all of this. Everyone that you see in the video is expected to be okay. I can just imagine that was a pretty scary situation for anyone that happened to be there.